Well, hello and welcome to what is looking like a really intriguing quarter-final second leg. This, of course, the decisive game. It has been very, very close up to now. The first leg result sets us up a truly enthralling encounter. The hosts may not need to win, but their lead is a fragile one against opponents who have little choice, but truly to go for it. This could be tight to the very, very end. The stands here, the Corva, as the locals call them, make for quite an impressive sight, all in support of the grand old lady of the Italian game. Home team are in a good position here, but they're not quite over the line, and the crowd wants it done in style, Jim. Yeah, Peter, everything about this, I think, leans towards the predictability the first leg indicated. However, the players can't get carried away with the confidence of this atmosphere to back them. They have to make it happen and not fall into the mental trap of expecting it to happen. So they can't get lazy in their approach here at all in their heads. Uh, if they do that, then they could slip up. And that gets things running. Juventus are back home, having earned a lead in the away leg. But they are wary that the tie is only halfway through. Much work still to be done en route to the semi-final. Good save, he got a decent fist on that. Lulic. Well read, he sorted that out. And he can get that clear. That's a throw. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. It's Pacini, Mukatari, and here's Benzema. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Ilicic spreads it towards the left. Cristiano Ronaldo. Hoists it forward. Juan Mata. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Goes the goal! Goal! Juventus! And it's Juventus who take the lead! Oh, the invitation was received with such a clever run, and he had that defence in, in utter confusion. Juventus take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Manchester United, disappointing in the end there. They lack urgency. And here's Mkhitaryan. Hoists it high. Cristiano Ronaldo. Shapes to shoot! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Cristiano Ronaldo really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. <laughs> 
tries to get it clear. And here's tries a shot. Cristiano Ronaldo. Ronaldo was alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. He's found his man. Gets away from his opponents. And the ball's come out. Uh, it's a mistimed tackle, and it is a penalty. Juventus present their opponents with the best possible chance here. And he has shown him a yellow card. Uh, look at the amusement and dismay from the culprit, but the referee clearly thinks there was enough there for a penalty. Yeah, in truth there, it was carelessness and I think a little touch of panic, Peter, in that challenge. That usually leads to something unwanted. A formality, we're level! He was just never going to miss. Well, the keeper probably felt he could read that, but he's guessed completely wrongly. He's gone to the other side. This is threatening to become a really good game. Listen, goals change games, and that has changed the whole complexion of this one. They have the momentum now. Milner... Hits one! Just off target. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Uh, they're guilty of lacking inventiveness here, it's all broken down. Defenders on the back foot. Donnarumma sends that a long way. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Barry just did a brilliant job there. It was one of those all-or-nothing commitments, and he came up trumps. And he's going long. Mbappe. Mbappe showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Barry. Mbappe. Mata with a delicate ball. Now it's Ashley Young. Ashley Young. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, that's a fine save! Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. And it's Juan Massa. Played out to the right. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. He's through. He gets past his man. Bends him up. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. He's gone for it. His position was perfect, the invitation was there for him, and his response absolutely clinical. Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think you have to give credit where it's due, and it was a brilliant setup and finish.
Juventus two up and into a position of real strength. Listen, it's up to them now how they think about it from here because for me it's crying out for them to force the issue. Milner takes the long option. Clears it out of harm's way. And the referee brings the first half to a close. So a really good half of football, three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Well, we've had plenty to go at in that first half, Peter, and it's a, a fragile lead that could quite easily change hands in, in the second. Uh, if you like your football unpredictable, I think you're at the right match. Juventus head into the half-time break with a narrow lead, two goals to one. So we're just settling back into this second half. Chance! And the defence can get it clear. Ashley Young. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Skirtle. Lulic. Milner set up one goal so far. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Mbappe. And the Herrera. Now it's Mkhitaryan. And it's Milner. He's through the middle. Cristiano Ronaldo. That's it back. It speaks for itself, doesn't it? Best left there. Barry as well to read it and intercepts. Looking to hit the front line. It's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. There's a long ball. Ronaldo is being kicked on here. Yeah, now that he scored, this defence is on high alert. Mbappe! Forward it goes. Tries to get it forward quickly. He's there to receive it. Has a hit! There's a goal! Manchester United are back on level terms. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. So here comes a substitution. We have got ourselves a game here. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. This game plan could near well reward them with an equaliser. Now it's Muller going through, and he's cut it out. Manchester United are making a change now. And it's hoisted clear. Piquet. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Piquet. out wide now in with the challenge and it's played forward going for goal and the keeper's relieved to see that disappear wide look I'm sure he'll deny it Peter but the keeper didn't have that covered
There's a player in need of attention here. Yeah, and the manager's concerned too. Substitution time, perhaps, or maybe not. We'll see. And it appears he's going to be OK, at least for now. So, time for changes on both sides, actually. Hit long and direct. Pepe goes looking. Douglas Costa. Douglas Costa. Douglas Costa. He's had a goal! Size all around the ground. Horrible miss. Well, we could be headed for a scenario in which next goal is the winner. That chance could have been it too. Court won't enjoy that. <laughs> That's a foul. Free kick's been given. Played in with accuracy. Done very well to intervene. And it's PK right through the middle. Looking to force it. It's Juan Mata! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Manchester United know they can rely on the counter and they've just expressed a warning. Dashing forward at pace. Manchester United have a simple task to find something sustained now and keep the pressure on. He's gone for it! It's come back out! Oh, he's really drilled it. Cristiano Ronaldo can strike him with the very best. It just lacked the accuracy to trick the keeper. Tried to play it through. Yeah, I mean, he, I think he did well to, to spot the run. He just didn't get enough behind it. It happens. <laughs> Tries to get it forward quickly. Breaks on here. Benzema cut out in the nick of time. Cini gets it back. Oh, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. And he is going into that little black book. Oh, there is concern on the faces of the players standing around him here. Well, what possessed him to do that, Peter, I have no idea. It's, uh, it's not in keeping with the quality of the performance. Look long this time. And that is that. Juventus through to the last four. Just two more steps now. They have got a crack at it. Given the outcome of the first game, Jim, what are you thinking now? 
Well, they did all their good work in the first leg and knew that protecting their lead was the priority here, and I would add that it was done 